school because it was the school that I was in the school boundaries for but it's a lot nicer than like the other high school that I was um, that I was close to going to because I live right on the borderline so I'm really glad that I go to Union instead of Evergreen because like it's just a lot nicer and plus it's the newest school in the district. Out of the Four subjects. It used to be science because of experiments, but it really changes between math and science for me based on the teachers that I have that year. And this year it's math because that's where I have my favorite teacher. A good teacher is someone who will actually put time into showing examples or clearly explaining. Like I have had teachers who would just sit at their desk and give us a textbook and tell us to do the problems without explaining anything. So I didn't learn anything. But this year, my one of my teachers, he's my favorite teacher, but he really goes through everything clearly and he will show examples and he'll always be asking if you guys, if the class needs help with any problems and he's always willing to help us out and show us how to do it. I absolutely hate English. This year, it's especially because of the teacher, but I mean, I've always, it's always been my least favorite subject because I never like to write and like, I don't like to read novels, which is what they expect you to read in English. Like, I like to read like comics or manga. And then they're always saying, oh, you have to be at the grade level reading, but I never do that. And then I just hate writing. Some teachers, they actually care, but then other, I mean, I guess they all care, at least like a little, but there's some that care a lot more than others, and there's some people that you just can't read. I must admit that they are a distraction, but they can also be helpful, like if you're stuck on something, and then you could just like text a friend and be like, hey, do you understand this? Can you help me out? Like, especially if you're like too shy to ask the other people around you, then that's helpful. And then just like, I know a lot of people don't carry around like calculators, so having a phone with the calculator is really nice. Definitely every period, even the ones where you're not supposed to have your phone out. Then I get addicted because I check my notifications, but sometimes I'll just be checking it to see the time. I'm being completely honest, like it's cool that they get involved and all, you know, like less boring, but also Sometimes there are people who I really hate and I will want to attack them so I will not want to get in trouble for attacking people so I feel like they shouldn't really get involved with that. School is just pretty much the same every day. I hang out with the same people. Sometimes it gets boring but like that's already to be expected if it's the same thing happening every day. But yeah, it's just same classes, and like different work, but it's all miserable work. Not really, I was just hoping that it would be a lot better than middle school, but so far it's been failing me, and I hate both of them, but I will just suffer. I just hope to make a lot of more friends, like long lasting friends, and then also maybe find like the career that I would want to pursue in life because I still don't know that yet and people always say that it's okay to not know but like I feel like sometimes just pressure to already have what you want to do planned out.